So what are we dealing with here? Well, the normal question, the first question is always, what is a copyright zombie? No, they're not real zombies. Zombies, in the true sense of the word, are reanimated dead. These creatures are not actually dead. In this case, only their spirit is dead. They stumble along, full of fear, all thinking about their own creative rights and how they've died. That's the difference. Fear has turned them into zombies. The RIAA, the MPAA, evil librarians, John Doe lawsuits, and fear-mongering FBI threats in front of movies have slowly pushed these people over the edge. So are copyright zombies intelligent? Can they actually use content? Basic skills remain a more remembered behavior from a former life. There are reports of these creatures using content, but even that are the most primitive. The use of external content and citations and so forth, I might point out to you that even animals will adopt the basic use of resources in this manner. But, but these copyright zombies, they look just like us. How do we make the distinction... These creatures are nothing more than pure copyright-controlled automatons. We must not be lulled by their outward appearance of normalcy, for they will attempt to enslave you as well. Their fear is based on false knowledge and old concepts, and it is both highly contagious and devastatingly infectious. Dummies! 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 Listen, listen, quiet. Shh. One wonders whether it's worth saving at all. For all I know, all the brains are dead, and it's the idiots that are still alive. I see you're here. And I figured out how to stay here, young lady. I figured out how to survive. And I'm trying to help you dummies. In your calm, helping way, you really do irritate people. Calm, helping way. Illogical way. Illogical hell. Illogical hell. Abolishing intellectual property is the only way to free ourselves from them. Freedom from whom? From a whole specimen that is walking around in increasing numbers. Are you suggesting that we, we disregard copyright? What else are you going to do? Give me an alternative. I thought you scientists would come up with some sort of coherent plan, but this doesn't make any sense. Well, I can think of one alternative. Well, I could think of several alternatives, actually, yes. To stay safe and sane in this desolate land of copyright zombies, you have but three choices. First, fair use. Know your rights. It's your only defense. Second, public domain, where copyright has died a natural death. And thirdly, Creative Commons. Creative Commons is the newest weapon in the arsenal against the copyright undead. You're probably serious. I'm deadly serious. What are the choices? They won't stop persecuting and prosecuting, young lady. They won't stop as long as we're alive. See, the things we're talking about here, it's, it's just people talking. This is not political rhetoric. This is not the Democrats versus the Republican. They've got us in the economic hole, or we're in another war. It's more crucial than that. We're down to the line, folks. We're down to the line. There are no divisions amongst the living. Shh, please, quiet. Let him finish, please. We have got to remain rational, unemotional. We've got to remain rational, logical, logical. Scientists logical. always think in these terms it doesn't work. That's not how people really are. We've got to remain logical. We've got to. There's no choice. It has to be that. It has to. It's that or the end.